it doesn't feel good to work 10 hours a day and bring home $60. That is a slap in the face. My son's 14 years old. I've been working fast food 10, the last 10 years, like I barely even know him. Like I don't miss all these years of my son's life, barely just putting food on the table, maybe. Every year the, the, the uh, associations that spend the most on lobbying are consistently the Chamber of Commerce and the Minnesota Business Partnership, uh, representing the interests of businesses. Uh, in both cases, they try to put out a, a facade of that they're representing small businesses or mom and pops, but in reality, the people calling the shots are actually the largest corporations in the state. When you get there, there's no meet and greet. It doesn't feel like a welcome a welcoming place. Um, you're on your feet eight hours. There's no cushion between you and the concrete floor. You barely have to, you have to beg for a break sometimes. You're gonna work and you're gonna work hard for that seven and a quarter and they're gonna make sure of it. You have to have a thick skin in order to work at these places because the things that the people say to you as customers and um, the people you work with as far as management, if you don't have a thick skin, like it can easily hurt your esteem. Employers will tend to do whatever is best for their profits uh, and even means uh, we've seen sacrificing workers' health and safety and, and well-being. I can pay my lights and my gas maybe, or I can pay my rent and maybe my bills like for an extra $2 an hour, which is still barely enough money, but it's at least money so I can have somewhere to live. It won't guarantee I have somewhere to eat or it won't guarantee I have, um, I'll have clothes, but it'll at least make sure I have somewhere to live at.